Algebra is a branch of math in which you find unknown or missing numbers. You use variables or letters to represent numbers that are unknown. This is Gunner. He is Mrs. Gary's dog. Like most dogs, Gunner loves treats. Uh-oh, Mrs. Gary accidentally left out a plate of eight treats. Luckily, Gunner has a lot of self-control. He resists and patiently waits for her to return so she can give him permission to eat the treats. But eventually, he can't resist the temptation he needs some treats. There were eight treats, but some treats were eaten. Now there are seven left on the plate. We will use the variable t to represent our unknown number, which is the amount of treats that were eaten. Eight minus t equals seven. Eight is the whole number and seven is a part. What is the missing part? To solve for the unknown number, I think to myself eight minus what number equals seven. I can also think backwards and move from right to left. Seven is a part. If I add one to seven, I can get the whole eight. He ate one treat. Now Gunner has gone back for seconds. There were seven treats on the plate. Now there are five. The equation that represents the problem is seven minus t equals five. To solve, I can think seven minus what number equals five, or I can work backwards. Five plus what number equals seven? Five plus two equals seven. T equals two. Gunner can't stop. He had to go back for more. There were five treats on the plate, and now there are three. 5 minus t equals 3. I know that 3 plus 2 equals 5, so t must equal 2. Oh no! He has finished the plate. 3 minus t equals 0. t equals 3. Gunner, I guess I don't blame you though. Those treats did look delicious. Gunner also loves to play with tennis balls in the backyard. Mrs. Gary recently bought him a pack of 25. Now she can only find four balls. How many balls are buried or scattered in the backyard? 25 is the hole, or the number of tennis balls they started out with. I'll use the variable b to represent the tennis balls. 25 minus b equals four. It seems a bit difficult to work backwards from right to left with this one, so I'll flip flop the four in the variable. 25 minus four equals 21. b equals 21. There are 21 balls hidden in the yard. Good luck, Miss Gary. You'll need it.